Namaste, Namaskar, Vanakam, Sastriyakal, and welcome back to Grow with the Jan family. I'm Anjali, and today we're going to be reacting to Akshay Kumar's speech from the movie Namaste, London. Yes, and this I feel like has been a request for a while, and I've noticed it a lot more recently. So um, we finally put it at the top of our list, and we're doing it today. Yes. And um, we know Ashkay Kumar a little bit. We've seen him in a few other movies. Um, the most recent was the trailer for uh, Mission Mango, um, which looks amazing. And that just came out August 15th, so I hope that was, I really want to see that one too. There's so many movies on our list now that I want to see, um, and not enough time in the day and the week. So, But I did want to read a little bit about his background because I don't know a lot about him personally. Um, I've just seen him in a few uh, different movies. So, Indian-born Canadian actor, producer, television personality, martial arts, stuntsman, philanthropist who works in Bollywood films. Spanning over 29 years, has appeared in over 100 films, won several awards, and he's established himself as one of the prominent actors in Hindi cinemas, beginning his acting career in the 1990s. Um, done dramatic roles, romantic comedies, so a little bit of everything. Um, also has done some of his own stunts. Married with two children. He likes to keep him out of the spotlight, so that's good. <gasps> He's a six-degree black belt. Uh -uh. Six-degree black belt. Yeah. Anji's a black belt. Yeah. Um, we were working on moving up, but uh, she decided she wanted to try field hockey for something different, so... Yeah. Uh, we're doing that now instead, but six degree. Wow. That's higher than even her karate instructor. We needed five million cores to aid drought affected people. Um, promoted the mobile phone app, Bharat Kavir, which allows users to donate money to families who sacrifice their lives for India. Um, yeah, so he's done a lot of charity work as well, yeah. which is really nice. I love to see that. So this is the country. Yes. So let's get ready and start it up. Looks like a party, fancy, yeah, fancy party. Dad, mom. This is Charlie's aunt Pauline and her husband, Mr. William Knott. How do you do? Hello. Oh, Pauline! So shocked to see a nude she picture on a beach in some newspaper. I can't carry it. No, no, no. What? Uh, what she meant to say was, uh, <laughs> she's very upset with the press uh, for what they're doing with respected <laughs> people like you. So don't. Could you be carry it? Carry it. Could you carry it? Jazz, this is Mr. John Pringle. He's got an old connection with you already. His great-grandfather was a high-ranking officer of the East India Company. Oh, really? Oh, this Hi. is my fiance, Jazz. Jazz? Isn't that a kind of music? So when did Indians have such fancy names, Charlie? Actually, it's short for Jasmine. Just me. Oh, then Jazz must be your attempt to be one of us. That's one smart girl you've got there, Charlie. And I don't blame her. She doesn't want to be known as coming from the land of snake charmers, right? <laughs> Tell me, yeah. Jazz, do they still do the um, Indian rope trick in your country? Uh, no, Mr. Pringle. And it's actually not just the land of snake charmers, right, Charlie? Yes, sir. It's not just the land of snake charmers. It's also a land of chicken tandoori and corsetters. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously. You know India's not just all that, right? Oh, of course, my dear. India's not all that. Fortunately, Charlie doesn't know. But I do. Winston Churchill once said, if we ever left India, it would be run by the goons. <laughs> and my God, it is. <laughs> if you'll just excuse me. <laughs> Certainly, my dear. So, Mujhe bura laga, kyunki main Indian ho. Lekin tumhe kya hua? Tumhe kyun bura laga? तुम तो ब्रिटिशर हो। कर छोड़ो। तुम कहीं की भी रहने वाली हो। रहोगी तो तुम इंडिया नहीं ना। चलो। कहाँ? 
उसके परदादा ने कोई और इंडिया देखा है असल इंडिया की सैर करवाते हैं उसमें Mr. Pringle, oh. he would like to tell you something about India. I oh, really, I'm all ears. Namaste. Mm. Sir, my name is Arjun Singh. Wide. पांच हजार साल पुरानी सभ्यता की वजह से हम हिंदुस्तानी सबको ऐसे ही चुके प्रणाम करते हैं। When we greet one another, we fold our hands in namaste because we believe that God resides in the heart of every human being. ऐसी सभ्यता जिसमें कैथलिक औरत प्रधानमंत्री की कुर्सी एक सिख के लिए छोड़ देती है और एक सिख प्रधानमंत्री पद की शपथ एक मुस्लिम राष्ट्रपति से लेता है उस देश की बागडोर संभालने के लिए जिसमें 80 प्रतिशत लोग हिंदू हैं। We come from a nation where we allow a lady of Catholic origin to step aside for a Sikh to be sworn in as Prime Minister by a Muslim president to govern a nation of over 80% Hindus. आपकी मातृभाषा अंग्रेजी पूरी दुनिया में सबसे ज्यादा हमारे ही देश में घसी है। और आपको शायद ये भी नहीं पता होगा कि अंग्रेजी के ज्यादातर शब्द संस्कृत से लिए गए हैं। संस्कृत का शब्द मात्र अंग्रेजी में मदर बना, भ्रात्र बना ब्रदर, ज्यामिति बनी ज्यामिट्री और त्रिकोण मिति बनी ट्रिग्नोमेट्र it may also interest you to know that many of the origins of your words come from Sanskrit. For example, Matru becomes mother, Tatra becomes brother, Geometry becomes geometry, Trikonometry becomes trigonometry. आपको शायद ये बात दिलचस्प लगे कि हमारे यहाँ 21 भाषाओं में 5,600 अखबार और 3,500 मैगज़ीन छपती हैं जिनको पढ़ने वालों की संख्या 12 करोड़ है। आपके देश के मुकाबले में कई ज़्यादा हैं। We have 5,600 newspapers, 35,000 magazines, and over 21 different languages, with a combined readership of 120 million. जान तक पहुँच गए हम, लेकिन अब भी आप लोगों को हम हिंदुस्तानियों के हाथ में सिर्फ सांप की पीन ही नजर आती है। we have reached the moon and back, but yet you people still feel that we have only reached as far as the Indian rope trips. Doctors, engineers, or scientists ki ginti mein, janab ham sirf do mulko se bichi. We have the third largest pool in the world of doctors, engineers, and scientists. Ye thi dimag ki baat. Ab karte hain taqat ki baat. Dunya mein tisri sabse badi forge hamare yahan. Ab kya? Fir bhi. I will give you a shame to you because we don't understand you as small or small. Namaste. Maybe your grandfather didn't tell you that we have the third largest army in the world. And even then, I fold my hands in humility before you because we don't believe that we are above or beneath any individual. Well said. Well said. Well said. Well said. वो सब जानने के लिए मैं मनोज कुमार की पूरब और पश्चिम की डीवीडी आपको भेज दूंगा इन्हें दे दो। And Namaste. Wow, he really does a great job defending India for her. I mean, her boyfriend didn't seem to care, and he kind of went along with the other guy. Yeah, it was like yeah, somebody. Wasn't very nice and thought yeah. he very stereotypical responses, you know, and, and like, very uh, snobbish. He realizes like she's her hometown is India, and he's just like, "Oh, you wanted to change your name because you were the thing of you didn't want to be the called from snake charmers from India." That's just like so rude. And the other thing is, I don't think Jasmine's her real name. I think he said that so. She wouldn't actually say her real name mm. because the her um, fiance was like Jasmine before she said her own name. So right. yeah, it's just uh you know hopefully in this is an older movie you can tell but yeah you would hope this day and age people wouldn't respond to other people like that like not yeah. even just. You know, there's no reason to be rude. Those comments were just... But the best way, I guess, and he has the right idea, the best yeah. way is just to come back with facts and information about how great India is, you know? That's the way to do it. There's no punching or fighting. Like this is like, you know... Let me tell you a little bit about India, how yeah. great it is, you know. It's like they just assume things in their mind, and then they just, like, work those out without even thinking of the facts, how 
India does it, what India um, can create? Well, it's some of it is pride and some of it is ignorance and you know the more you know like we're learning so much now about India and I feel like um, every day we're learning something new it's not just oh I, I know that no like there's so many new things to learn and that goes for everywhere but you can't yeah. assume you know a lot of the stuff is very maybe stereotypical what people say and they just assume you're from this country you're from that country this is how you are yeah and that's not cracking open the surface at all you know it's not learning anything you're, yeah you know talking crap is what you're talking so the more you know you know and and the better knowledge you have it's it's just, but he defends India so well. Like, you know, Vande Mantram is playing in the background, which I love. And, um, you know, he really, like, facts. He's yeah. not talking like this is how it should be. He's saying, like, you know, Real most facts. doctors, you know, in the world and engineers, they're very smart, you know, Speak space 21 launch. 21 languages. Yeah, many languages. And it just goes on and on and on about all the great things. You're one of the yeah. largest armies in the country the third largest army in the country he's not stating anything that anybody could open wikipedia and find out themselves but you have to open a book or you speak garbage out you know yeah just upsets me um but he did a really good job i mean reminds me of um the u.n ambassador when we did that mm -hmm. speech yeah. how you know he really um Um, he really defended India well like and he really you know he took questions from Pakistan which you know was having they have some issues with each other and you know he really answered so eloquently and made you feel so proud of India in the end yeah. you know and uh, Dr. Thoreau we did his speech too you yes. know and uh, you know and he talked about words that the British took you know loot that was one of the ones I remember he said yeah. um, you know and, and used it as geometry. their own yeah this one they said geometry and uh, mother and so there was some other and ones brother. yeah and um, you know hopefully this day and age you know we we talked about reparation and and yeah the british need to apologize you know you can't say you didn't do any harm there's so many things out mm -hmm. there that say otherwise i think we get that it's like it's not this future's fault it's not this right present's fault it's not yeah the people, people nowadays i don't think anybody's still alive that was around when these yeah. things happened you know it's great it's generations you know past but you know apologizing or you know just not treating others like this like yeah. hopefully most people don't believe the way this guy was coming off like hopefully um you know everybody has a better idea about india about the yeah. culture you know and and hopefully you know there's some um, you know, sadness and sorrow for the things that the British did f towards them, even if it's not your fault. I'm I'm hoping that most people don't act like this guy did, like very arrogant, like he knew better. And he, he sounds like somebody who was there 200 years ago and would treat people like yeah. crap. So uh, hopefully that's not the case nowadays. You know, I really, um, you know, Ashley Kumar, really defend India well. Like if you're... In, yeah. You know, you can't let people walk all over you. And she kind of, you know, when he started saying that, she kind of stayed quiet. But then Locked it hurt away. her heart. You could tell. Like, you know, she may act a little different in front of them, but in her heart, she's Indian. In her heart, we're still Indian. We're still Indian. Yeah. You know, like, so it hurt her soul. And, you know, for him to... To take her and say we're gonna fix this pretty much you know I mean set them straight because yeah. they need to know the facts they're talking 
something that has nothing to do with that, you know. And we do all these things, these reaction videos and learning so much, like the Chandran 2, the launch, yeah. and, uh, you know, the first, the south side of the moon. It's only a few more, it's like another week, I think we get to see, hopefully, you know, we're praying it all goes well, lands well, and brings back lots of good information for everybody yes. all over the world, you know, um, and collaborate. I mean, India is such a great country of diversity, you know, yeah. like he said, the, you know, the Christian and a Muslim and a Hindu. And I mean, there's so many, it doesn't matter. You, you know, mm -hmm. Syed is a Muslim and he's defending India. Yeah. You know, it doesn't, you don't have to be one kind and that diversity makes it better. It brings people together yeah. and then you get all these great inventions. You get all these great people that come out of it. Like and so much more happens. Sorry, yeah. go ahead. No, it's okay. And one of my favorite sayings from India, they said, um, if you bring peace to us, if you're nice to us, we'll welcome you with open arms. Right. And he's like, we say namaste and bow our head because we believe everybody is equal you know yeah. you i'm not above you or below you yeah we yeah you come to india with open arms and shake my hand we are friends welcome and that's how it should be every country yeah. should be like that it shouldn't matter the color of your skin the, your religion your religion where you come from yeah it shouldn't matter everybody is a human being at the end of the day everybody you know their heart beats and you know it just it, that's how it should be. Yeah. You should welcome people with open arms. Diversity, I believe, makes you stronger. I mean, you get, and you see all the great accomplishments that have come out of India, and people yeah. are from all over. Yeah. And I think when you collaborate together and work together, only good things come from that. I so believe that. So. Yeah. This was amazing. Sorry it took us so long to finally react to it. Yeah. Um, but we loved it so yes makes us proud of india yeah and if you like this video don't forget to hit that like button down below because the more you like the more youtube shares our videos yep and don't forget to subscribe and join our wonderful family and we'll see you tomorrow bye, bye.